guys, Jackboy Okay, no hand. You can go about that. But hi guys, Jackboy Sixty Ball here. Today I'm going to be telling you about. Well, actually, not necessarily telling you about. All three are most likely going to be comparing the Attack Forty Five to the pistol. Because pretty much my attachment choice will be the exact same as it's all four semi all pistol. But my um, camo choice would be the. Um, what's it called? And that's me testing to see if. So I got flashbangs and concussions mixed up. Like how they work as con. Okay, no, 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 no. I'm not gonna go into that. Um, okay! Not like flashing stun wise, but like. How they go. I don't want to go into that though, so yeah, let's just roll on. I didn't achieve my goal in this, like, I didn't achieve my goal to get a fast bag because I just gave up and said this is good enough gameplay. Because like I said in the last video, my trigger finger's bad. So pretty much I'm going to be comparing it to the 5.7. It has less ammunition than the 5.7, even with an extended mag is a bit of a rip off. That's why I decided to use FMJ, which I said was a good attachment. It only gives you three more bullets, and that's not going to do anything. I guess it gives you more ammunition in general, because if you have extended mags, you actually get more extra ammunition anyway. If you think about it, extra mag, extra ammunition. Okay, um, that's not what I'm talking about. But like the 5.7, it does, um, it has a much better two hit kill range, or one hit kill range, I can't remember. Because... The 5.7 is a 3 hit kill pistol, 3 or 4 hit kill pistol, but that's why a lot of ammunition comes to use. I prefer the look of the 5.7, you know the TAC 45, I can accept it's better. You know I prefer the 5.7, just because it looks better. Um, what else? Oh yeah, the TAC 45, I don't know what else to say. Um, oh yeah, I like to use the what's it called? You know when the new camos come out? That's one of the new camos that came out quite a while ago. A while back. Like pretty much camos came out, personalised camos, and then some more new ones came out just recently. Like, not recently actually, it was still a long time ago. Pretty much that's one of them. I don't know why people like pack a bunch of Okay, okay. I'm getting sidetracked. I guess I haven't got much to explain. I've got uh, like 8 minutes of footage or 9. Um, the ECL camo packs. A pack of punch I didn't really like, but I don't know why people want it so much. So it didn't look that good to me. Anyway, let's continue. I mean, let me continue. Um. Oh yeah, that's one of my new M1s, that isn't in the thing video. Near the, um, after January, I'm gonna, like I said ages ago, I'm gonna do a bunch of videos on all my M1s again of 2013. Now, okay, let me not get sidetracked. I don't know what else to say about this pistol, really. Because I'm comparing it, and I've already done that. My attachments is the same as the 5.7, like I said. And I don't go on a straight stuff like, oh wait, what I like about it, um, like I said, I prefer the 5.7 over it, because it looks better and all that. I like, just like the look of it better. I don't know what else to say. The iron sights on this are budgier than the 5.7, but it, yeah, I don't know. It's the better pistol in a way. Um, what else do I want to do? Oh yeah, I say even. I have nothing else to say. All it says I was using FMJ and the class setup was pretty much the same as the 5.7. Pretty much go to the 5.7 video and say, hear what I said about that because pretty much attachment wise would be the exact same as the 5.7 as it's another semi-auto pistol. So, yeah, I've got out to say, I'm sorry about that. So, I'll see you next episode with the, um, 
B27R, which will be a different story as it's a semi auto pistol. I mean, not semi auto, it's not a semi auto pistol even, it's like burst fire. So, yeah, this. And I'll be using the same class, I might make some authorizations if I want to. But yeah, so yeah, Jackboy64, we're not signing off on making the next video. Jackboy64. See you in the next video, I guess. I really should find out a see you in the next video sign off. Rather than say, okay, I'm not signing off so and so with that. Give me one in the comments below, I really want one so badly. And a sign off. Maybe even an intro. Pretty much a sign off, a see you in the next video, and a intro maybe. But I'm all okay with me intro. So yeah, that's all I've got to say. Let's sign off for six minutes, shall we? We'll see you in the next video. Three, two, one.